There's a WhatsApp feature called Privacy Checkup, and very few people even know it exists. This feature literally reviews all your privacy settings one by one and tells you who can see what and what you need to change immediately to protect your privacy. In simple terms, it's like a security scanner built right into the app. Just a few minutes of your time can make a huge difference in how you use WhatsApp. Follow along. How to open it? Open the WhatsApp app. Tap the three dots at the top right. Select Settings, then tap Privacy. You'll find something called Privacy Checkup. Once you open it, you'll notice that WhatsApp shows it as a series of organized steps. Each step reviews a specific type of privacy setting. It's like going through a short test or quick tour that reveals everything about what information of yours is visible to others. You'll find four main sections, and each section contains a group of settings you need to review or change based on your needs. Let's go through each one in detail. One, choose who can contact you. Who can add you to groups? Always keep it on contacts only, or my contacts except this prevents random people from adding you to strange groups or sending unwanted invites. Block unknown calls. This feature allows you to block calls from numbers that aren't saved in your contacts. Make sure it's turned on. Block specific contacts. You can also block certain contacts and control their access to you. Two, control your personal information. Here, you can decide who can see your profile photo, everyone, contacts only, or nobody. Choose what suits you best. You can also manage who can see your last seen and online status, whether it's everyone, your contacts, or no one. Plus, you can turn read receipts on or off. If you turn them off, people won't see the blue ticks when you read their messages. Three, add extra privacy and security to your chats. You can lock the app itself by adding fingerprint or face unlock so that only you can open WhatsApp. You can also use disappearing messages and choose how long messages stay before they automatically delete after being sent. Four, strengthen your account protection. You can create security keys or verification codes to secure access to your WhatsApp account. You can also add an email address, which helps you recover your account and regain access easily if you ever lose your phone or forget your PIN. In the end, this feature isn't just a simple setting, it's a complete security review tool. WhatsApp introduced it because the number of hacking and data theft incidents has increased dramatically. Many users have had their photos stolen or um, accounts cloned simply because they left their privacy settings at the default values. I hope this guide helped you see you in the next video.